What is up guys, it's your boy Paul here coming at you with another video today. Uh, look, today what I wanna talk to you guys about uh, and I, what I wanna ask you the question of is uh, what have you done recently that has shocked yourself? And here's what I mean. What have you done recently that uh, you have done that is normally not in your normal routine, not in your normal schedule, but it has shocked you and created uh, a growth spurt? The idea of where this comes from is uh, and when, whenever you're working out, if you've ever heard the term shocking your muscles, like you gotta shock your muscles, uh, which then creates massive growth in your muscles. I remember the first time that I ever heard about this was between my ninth and 10th grade year. Um, and I worked out with a dude for three weeks. I didn't work out all summer, but I worked out three weeks before uh, I went into my sophomore year. And I gained, I think it was 10 or, 10 or 15 pounds within three weeks. And at this point, I was not taking protein. I was not taking any of the stuff. Just with this guy, I had shocked my muscles so much that it caused a massive growth spurt uh, within my muscles. And so this idea I've carried over uh, into my workouts now, uh, and actually just the other week, because normally I've been going on uh, a bike for 30 minutes and doing a workout on the bike before I hit either my legs or my arm, like upper body. Uh, and then this week, I've actually switched it up on myself, and it was crazy, the amount of pump that I got uh, in my legs or in my upper body whenever I switched up the routine because I've been going on the same routine for like three weeks, and then this week I switched it up, was crazy. And the uh, how much more reps I was able to do because it was at the beginning of my workout rather than after I did the bike uh, was pretty crazy. And so that led me to ask, okay, what other areas of my life have I shocked myself in this way that I have switched up my routine in such a way that my brain is not used to it, that my body is not used to it, uh, and then as a result will cause uh, a massive growth spurt. Right, and so this is this is something that I'm currently doing on myself right now. Uh, that I want to ask you guys the same question: What areas of your life do you have right now that have just been so routine for you, and you've just been seeing the same results that you've been seeing for a while? Right? What areas of life, your life right now, uh, do you have that have been doing the same thing over and over and over, and you've been seeing the same results? Look, one of the reasons why uh, we have you know people have mediocre lives is because they're doing the same thing day in, day out, expecting different results. And that's just not how stuff works. You have to switch things up. And if you watch this channel, you know how uh, big I am about routines and about planning your day and everything like that. But yet there are sometimes certain times when you need to switch up your routine in order to shock your mind, shock your muscles, shock whatever, shock yourself in order to hit the next growth spurt. And then sometimes that becomes the new routine. And so each time you level up, it has to do with shocking your muscles. Do something that's unpredictable. So this is kind of you know a, a paradoxical thing here. We got, we're saying have your routine and do this, but we're also saying don't have a routine, mix it up. So within your routine, see if you can switch up the order of how you do things sometimes purely and test results. Test the results. Let's say you're a morning person. Let's say that you uh, love to always do the most stuff in the morning. Uh, like I know for me, you know, I love to do my intellectual stuff in the morning. I love reading in the morning. I love, you know, have my quiet time in the morning, all this stuff. Well, what would happen um, if I were to work right after my quiet time instead of reading? What would happen, you know, if I were to work out, for example, right after my quiet time instead of reading? What would happen if I were uh, to go out and, you know, leave the apartment and start prospecting right after I were to do my quiet time instead? Start thinking about these different areas of your life and see when you can switch things up to where it's unpredictable for yourself, challenge yourself, test yourself, and look at results. See if any of the results are different. Because sometimes we fall into the same mediocre pattern and expect the same exact numbers because, let's be real, why would we expect different if we're not doing anything to change it, right? So in the same way that I saw a different result with my workouts because uh, I switched up the order of things which made me get a lot more pump in the beginning, um, see what areas of life you can do this with that you are currently stagnant in right now. If you are currently stagnant in any area of your life, no matter what it is, ask yourself, what can I do to shock myself for this area of my life? How, in what way? Do I need to switch up something within the thing itself? Do I need to move it to a different time of day? Do I need to bring someone on board? What can I do that's unpredictable that my brain says, oh, this is different. We gotta respond differently. We gotta produce differently, okay? Ask yourself this question uh, and let me know uh, what it does for you guys below. I'm so curious to hear uh, because when my friend introduced this concept to me uh, in between ninth and 10th grade, it changed the way I worked out. It changed the way I worked out and now every time I kind of hit a plateau, a plateau, I ask myself, 
how can I shock my muscles? And so, for example, the past three weeks, I was kind of seeing the same progression and I got used to it. So this week, I made a change. I made a change. And so then you can just start asking yourself that in different areas of life, okay? So look, that's today's video, guys. Uh, I want you guys to do this on your own. I want you guys to uh, run this experiment, ask yourself uh, where it is that you can shock yourself, that you can shock some area of your life right now, and then you know do it for a week and return back. Let me know in the comments below. Uh, I, I do wanna hear, if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you know someone who could use this video, maybe someone who's just constantly doing the same thing all the time, maybe they always preach routine, which I do myself too, but share this video with them as well. Uh, and as always, stay tuned for the next one. I'll see you guys later. All right, bye-bye.